Hello guys, in this video I will teach you how to implement WebView in Android app using Java. You can use WebView to build browser type application or uh, to load any websites in your application. Ok, let's start. Open Android Studio. Now let's create one project. Go to File, click on New, then click on New Project. Choose MPT Activity. Then click next, and give name your, your choice, uh, choose language as Java, choose minimum SDK as Android 21 and click on finish. Uh, it will create new project. I have already created project, so I will cancel this. Ok, after creating project, now let's go to uh, layout file, activity main.xml, let's open this. Here, default, you may have constant layout, uh, change that layout to relative layout, then here we are going to add one progress bar to show the uh, loading of websites and uh, we will add web view you can uh, add progress bar like this give id as loading progress bar uh, give style as uh, widget dot a compare dot progress bar dot horizontal uh, layout width match variant and height you can give 4 dp 2 dp or as your choice then below that add one web view Give ID as web view, uh, use width is match parent and height is match parent and use one parameter as layout below and here pass this this ID. Uh, we are going to put this web view below for guest bar. I will put this code link in description. Uh, you can view from there also. After doing this, let's open uh, main activity dot java file. Let's go to java then open main activity uh, here i have already declared some variable uh, i have declared variable of progress bar web view and i have declared one url uh, to load in this web view then inside one create uh, let's assign view by id progress bar is equal to find view by id loading for progress bar and m web view is equal to find view by id r dot id dot web view okay now to load Websites in this web view, we need to call some methods. Uh, let's do that. At first, mwebview dot load URL. Uh, here you can pass URL uh, you want to load. I will pass this uh, URL to load variable. I have already declared this websites. Uh, okay, let's pass URL to load. Okay, if we run our application like this. Uh, our URL will open in default browser not in our application so we need to add some other methods uh, to load URL in our application okay let's do that mwebview dot set web client new web client then we can change setting to our web view also let's do that mwebview dot dot get setting dot I have bunch of option here to change setting. For now, I will change uh, one setting only. Let's enable JavaScript in this web view. Set JavaScript enable uh, pass true. Then to track the progress of uh, loading, uh, we need to add another method also. Let's do that. I am web view dot set web chrome client new web chrome client and then override some method from here uh, we are going to override one method is on progress change it will give us the progress of loading it will give us the loading progress uh, in here inside here we are going to pass this uh, new progress in our progress bar uh, let's do that and progress bar dot set progress uh, pass new progress then let's implement another method also on title received uh, let's set this title in our toolbar by get supportable action bar dot set title then pass title okay now we have one remaining thing um, to complete a view uh, let's do that outside one create Let's override one backpress. 
okay let's do this before super dot on back press uh, let's check one thing if m web view dot can go back uh, here will pass m web view dot go back uh, <coughs> else uh, we are passing super dot on back press uh, okay this method will check if you can go back in website uh, we'll go back in previous page but if we are in main page of the website we'll close from that application okay one last thing remaining to load website from internet uh, we need to add internet permission let's go to android main page open that and here uh, let's is permission is uses permission and internet okay this much now let's run our application okay guys here is our application uh, here is for gris bar below that we have web view here we have loaded one website roshanrl.com.np okay here we have set the title in toolbar uh, it's roshan bar now let's click on uh, any of this link uh, it will open new link and here it's our four gears bar will update according to uh, loading okay guys now if we click back button we did not close application but we go into main page of that website okay let's check that okay here it is now uh, if we press back button we will go outside this application uh, because it is the main page of this website uh, let's test this okay here it is uh, by this way you can implement web view in your application uh, thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video please click on like button if you have any query please uh, comment down below and please subscribe my channel for more videos like this have a great day. Thank you.